2012 was an incredible year, and if you forgot what happened in 2012, let me go ahead and refresh your memory. Gangnam Style. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and apologize in advance because I know that's gonna be stuck in your head for the rest of the day, and uh, I'm the reason why it's gonna be stuck in your head for the rest of the day. But that is not all that happened in 2012. This right here was also released the same year, and I'm talking about Call Me Maybe by Carly Rae Jepsen. Um, I, once again, I'm gonna have to apologize because I know now both of those songs will be stuck in your head for the rest of the day. You're welcome. But all jokes aside, there was something released in 2012 that is honestly one of the better black and white Pokemon sets, and I am talking about Pokemon Dark Explorers was released on May 9th of 2012. Wait a minute. May 9th of 2012. Today, the video is releasing on May 9th. Today is the eight year anniversary of Pokemon Dark Explorers being released. So you know exactly what we gotta do. We have to open up this two pack of black and white Dark Explorers that was released on May 9th, 2012, exactly eight years ago. We are going to be opening it up in today's Pokemon opening, but we have to start off. We can't just jump right into it. No, no, no. We have to start off with a little bit of uh, the newest Pokemon set. I'm talking Rebel Clash. So we're going to open up some Rebel Clash, and then we're going to go into Dark Explorers, and then finish off with some Sword and Shield and some Cosmic Eclipse. Three of the newest Pokemon card sets released. I'm going to tell you all about who sent this in, and this is actually going to be a pack battle with none other than the one and only Jordan Fringe, my co-host of the Shadowless podcast that airs every single Wednesday. Uh, we are going to be uh, pack battling with this right here, not the rest of the booster packs, but let's go ahead and warm things up. We have to whet our appetite, if you will, for that Pokemon Dark Explorers. There's a lot of interesting cards that uh, was released in Pokemon Black and White Dark Explorers. Uh, one of them being a really, really interesting, well, I'll actually go ahead and tell you once we get a little bit closer to opening up those booster packs. Don't want to, don't want to, uh, you know, spoil it just yet for you. Beware, Skyla. We got a tool and a Scizor for our rare. Now, of course, we are trying to pull one of every single Pokemon card from Rebel Clash, and I do mean pull one of every single card. A little bit of a difficult task, if you ask me having to pull every single card. I can't buy them as singles off of eBay. I can't trade for them. I legit have to pull every single card before the next set gets released this August. Will it happen? Do you think we can make it happen? Impidimp, Bunnel Bay, Energy, Mascarin. We have a Tranquil, which is a bird, so go ahead and fly away, bird. Caterpie, and <laughs> the reason I'm laughing uh, is because we've opened up probably about four booster boxes worth of Rebel Clash, and this right here is legit my first boss's orders that I have ever pulled, and so I am very, very happy about that. You would have think four booster boxes by now, we would have pulled at least one boss's orders, but no. There we go, that is our very first one. Of course, uh, if you are curious, the most valuable card from Rebel Clash is going to be the Hyper Rare Boss's Orders. There's also a full art version, and then a reverse holo, and then a regular, uh, reg blah, 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 regular holo as well. Let's go on to our, what is this, our third booster pack. Now, as a lot of you know, this week, uh, I have been doing uh, some very interesting intros uh, uh, involving very funny skits uh, here on the channel. There wasn't one today, but they will be returning next week. I won't be doing them for every single video, but I will be doing them uh, periodically every single week. So uh, uh, they will be returning probably next upload if you want to catch up on what's been happening uh, in those skits, uh, the storyline, if you will. You can go back and check out all the videos from this week. I'll link you up at the very end of today's video if you are interested. Uh, but we have some uh, some very interesting things going on here, very funny. Um, something new that I've been introducing that I think uh, the Pokemon community will like. And 
Ultra rare, I'll take it, I'll take it. And uh, a lot of you have been giving me feedback and you have been saying that you absolutely love, love the skits. Uh, so they will be returning. Now I know they're not everyone's cup of tea, uh, so that's why I'm not gonna be doing them for every single video. Uh, you know, I'll still do videos like today that doesn't involve the skits for the people that, uh, breaking family members that don't uh, necessarily quite enjoy the skits, you know? I want to try to uh, make everybody happy and make everybody uh, and you know let everybody enjoy their time here is what I'm trying to say. All right, here we go. Next booster pack. We're just having a good time here on the channel, right? Trying to have a laugh, uh, smile. Galarian, Mr. Mime, Snover, Energy, Scoop Up Net, Heracross, Electrode, Medicham, and a Ludicolo. I would say. Those five packs treated us pretty well, honestly. An Ultra Rare and a uh, Hollow Rare Boss's Orders, which is like a $9 rare right now. Uh, to be honest with all of you, that's, a, that's pretty crazy for just a regular rare. But let's go ahead and move on to Pokemon Black and White Dark Explorers released on May 9th, 2012. Today is the eight year anniversary. And the reason why we are opening this up today is let me go ahead and fill you in on what both myself and Jordan French have been doing. Both myself and Jordan French have started charity fundraisers on both of our YouTube channels, trying to raise as much as possible for United Way worldwide. We both wanted to try to bring the entire Pokemon community together to try to to raise as much as possible to help with the current situation that is facing this entire world. This is just all such a crazy situation that the entire world is facing and uh, we wanted to try to bring the entire Pokemon community together to uh, to help out just any way we can. So we both started these charity fundraisers on both of our YouTube channels uh, and it will, all the money does go to a United Way worldwide. Uh, so anything that you are able to donate or even uh, share this video would be a huge huge help. There is a link down in the video description down below that will take you to United Way's website as well as the charity fundraiser page where you can donate if you are able to. Now I know everybody is in their own situation and I totally, totally understand that. So like I said, even if you're just watching this video or you share this video out, that right there helps a lot as well. So hopefully the Pokemon community can all come together and try to make as much of a difference as possible. You know I love every single one of you and I'm always always wishing you positive vibes and I'm sending all my love to every single one of you and your entire family. So thank you all so much for listening to that right there. I really, really appreciate it. I know you all want to see these Pokemon Dark Explorers booster packs. So let's go ahead and start the pack battle. Mr. Jordan Fringe honestly thinks that he can pull better cards out of his Dark Explorers booster packs than the Breaking Family. That right there is just rude, Mr. Jordan Fringe. So let's go ahead and open up this two pack right here of Pokemon Dark Explorers. And this was actually sent over by a really, really kind soul, an amazing person. I'm talking about Nick. And uh, a lot of you may know who Nick is. If you watch uh, Leon Hart's channel, Leon Hart, a friend of the channel, a friend of mine, uh, uh, Nick has been on Leon Hart's channel before. He was on uh, Leon Hart's channel last year uh, when uh, Lee was doing his uh, fundraising. And unfortunately, unfortunately, Nick could not be here on uh, either my channel or Jordan French channel uh, this year, obviously, because with, you know, travel restrictions and everything. But, but Nick was so kind, he wanted to show his support and send his love over for what we're doing with the charity fundraiser for United Way uh, Worldwide. He sent over these Dark Explorers booster packs out of the kindness of his heart, so please, Everybody in the comment section down below. I want you to simply just comment. Thank you Nick If you want to comment more than that you are more than welcome to but at least comment. Thank you Nick It was so kind of him to send this over and let both myself and Jordan fringe pack battle it out So Nick, uh, I know you're watching right now and thank you so much from the bottom of my heart I'm sending you positive vibes all the way to you and your entire family now this right here is a phenomenal phenomenal set we have Dark Explorers right here and Dark Explorers right here. Definitely one of the best 
black and white Pokemon TCG sets ever released. I there, There's three cards in here. There's three secret rares uh, that I'm going to be referring to. We got Gardevoir, we got Archeops, and we also have a secret rare Pokemon Catcher where the Pokemon Catcher itself, like the Ray, the Ray, the Pokemon Catcher itself is gold and the rest of the card is not. I honestly would love to pull that one the most or the Gardevoir, but honestly anything Anything, I know I opened up that terribly, I can't help it, but anything is going to be a, uh, a really, really awesome and interesting pull because we have not seen this set opened up in a long time. If you want to see more sets like this, black and white, heart gold, soul silver, opened up here on the channel, uh, let me know by leaving a like on this video. Uh, I want to see, I want to see the feedback or you can let me know in the comment section down below, I would appreciate it. We have Evie. Now don't forget, Jordan French's por uh, portion of today's pack battle is going to be down in the video description down below, a link to it. So make sure you go and watch Jordan's video as well. You can see who pulled the better cards out of their Dark Explorers booster packs. Whoa, loving the artwork on that right there. That takes me back. Wow, okay. Being ever so gentle with these cards, we got your mask. We got an Ultra Ball. We have a reverse hollow Zora. See if you can, there you go. You can see that reverse hollow pattern now. There we go. And our rare is going to a rare Leafeon. And I know Marie is going to be happy about pulling or about uh, us pulling an Evolution in today's Pokemon card opening. Everybody loves a good Evolution. Let me know your favorite Evolution down in the comments. I'm actually going to go ahead and sleeve up. Both of those, you know, it's a, it's a little bit older stuff. This this stuff right here is harder to come by. Uh, Dark Explorers, I think last time I looked, it was going for about $30 a booster pack. And when you have it in a two pack like this, it's going to go for a little bit more because it's kind of a specialty product. You know, we got the uh, that Shinx right there. We got that Luxio. And we got that Luxray. So a two pack would definitely uh, drive up the value because it's a specialty product. Okay, here we go, but we're not keeping it sealed. No, no, no. Nick sent these to open up, and that is exactly what we are doing. There's the code card once again for the lucky, lucky people that get to claim those. Wow, I wish we still had uh, those purple backgrounds. That would be awesome. Okay, one, two, three. Let's see what we got inside of this one. And don't forget, we're opening up more booster packs right after this pack right here. We have Joltik, Lillipup, a Dweeble, Plusle. Hey, hey, if I remember correctly, I think we pulled that Minin too. Yes, look at that. Plusle and Minin. I love how the artwork matches up right there. Look at that. I cannot believe we pulled both Plusle and Minin. Okay, that's awesome right there. Crustle. Jolteon, hey, there we go. Another evolution. We got Old Amber, Aerodactyl, and then our rare is going to a Hollow Rare Haxorus. There we go. At least we got a Hollow Rare. I'm not complaining about that at all. I'm going to go ahead and sleeve both of those up. And if you are curious to see Nick, uh, Obviously, he's not been here on this channel. He couldn't make it here this year. But if you would like to see him when uh, he appeared on Leon Hart's channel, I'm actually going to go ahead and put a link up in the upper corner of the screen that will link you to one of Leon Hart's videos where Nick was in it. And you can go and watch that one as well. We're all an entire community here. All the uh, all the Pokemon creators are an entire community, and we all support one another. So uh, go show uh, Nick and Leon Hart some love on that video. We got some really, really nice nice pulls. I'm loving that. I'm loving that right there. Let me know your favorite pull from the Dark Explorers booster packs. Hopefully we won against uh, against Jordan French. And Jordan French, good luck on your booster packs as well. All right. I wish, I wish, you know what? I, I, think, I think I might need to go get some more Dark Explorers because uh, I, I'm really craving to open up some more. Black and white and uh, heart gold, soul silver were a very interesting error. Error. Era. <laughs> Not error as an error Pokemon curse, but era. If I can speak today. Whew. Okay. That Dark Explorer is, uh, it's, uh, whew. It's got me, 
It's got me going there. It's got me going. It's got me all excited. If you uh, do not know, both myself and Jordan Fringe host a weekly Pokemon podcast where we discuss all the latest Pokemon news as well as what is going on in the Pokemon collecting world. Uh, that is uploaded every single Wednesday on iTunes, Spotify, wherever you listen to podcasts. It is called the Shadowless Podcast. It's honestly, it's we do about a two-hour episode every single week. Uh, a lot of fun and very interactive as well. So give it a listen. Let us know what you think. We uh, mainly focus on Pokemon collecting, not just cards, but anything Pokemon that can be collected. We talk about Energy, Promo Pass, Torkoal, Emipom, Snowrunt, and a Wishy Washy GX. We got an Ultra Rare pull out of Cosmic Eclipse. Of course, Cosmic Eclipse, a very, very difficult set to pull Ultra Rares from. Let's go into the next one. All right, let's see if we can get another Ultra Rare. If you have not heard, Hidden Fates, uh, Hidden Fates Pokemon 10s we discussed earlier this week in Monday's video are getting a reprint, a re-release to stores. So if you're looking to uh, get some more Hidden Fates or you missed out on uh, the last bit of Hidden Fates, you have another opportunity. And I will let you all know right now, as of this recording, now when this video goes live, that might be a different story, but as of this recording, Hidden Fates Pokemon Card 10s are available on the GameStop website, and uh, weirdly enough, they raised the prices on them to about $22. Uh, you know, originally they were $19.99, but $22, still a pretty good deal. You are limited to only two per purchase, so if you're looking for some Hidden Fates 10s, there you go, uh, GameStop website. Absol, Nosepass, and a Whimsicott. And there's the code card for that one. Last Cosmic Eclipse booster pack. And then we will finish up with Sword and Shield. I told you, Cosmic Eclipse is a difficult, difficult set to open up. Uh, Ultra Rares, Sandy Gas, Spiel, Energy, Ends Resolve, Mawile, Flareon, Upside Down Gallade, and an Entei for the rare. And weirdly enough, Entei is actually in Dark Explorers as well. Um, there was a full art in there. EXs were in Dark Explorers. It's crazy. Remember when EXs were a thing, right? Five more booster packs that we are ending on. Gotta stay hydrated with my Zevia as, <laughs> as it goes everywhere. I promise it didn't hit any of the cards. <sighs> Don't worry, everything's in a sleeve and nothing got wet anyways. We're here to have a good time, right? Right? If you don't know, both myself and Jordan talk about Zevia every single week on the podcast. It's legit our favorite drink. Um, if you don't know, it's actually zeros across the board. Uh, it's a great alternative to like soda. Um, it's just kind of like, a, basically like a seltzer water. Energy, Drizzile, Ordinary Rod. We got Sobble and a Drippion. And there's the code card right there. I usually drink water when I uh, when I film a video, but you know, since it's both myself and Jordan Fringe battling it out today, both you know co-host of the Shadowless Podcast, and that's our our official unofficial drink of the podcast. Uh, I figured I would go ahead and uh, open one up for you today. It's it's legit, just like a soda. Chin Chow Energy Quick Ball Mantine Dottler Salizalpede and a Durant. Is there a Dur uncle? No, just a Durant? Okay, that's fine. I know, I know my jokes are lame. I can't help it. Those are the only kind of jokes I have are lame ones. <laughs> okay, go into the next one. We have Silicobra, Blitbug, Goldeen, Yumper, Skrupi, Energy, Rhydon, Eldegoss, Air Balloon, Stunfisk, and a Raichu. If you are new here to the channel, thank you so much for taking the time out of your day. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, become part of the Breaking Family. We do all sorts of crazy Pokemon card videos here on this channel and other random Pokemon uh, items as well. I upload all throughout the week, uh, Monday through Friday. You know, I take I think one or two days off throughout the week, um, but 3 p.m., 3.30, uh, PM Eastern Standard Time is our typical upload time and then on the weekends is 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time about four to five videos every single week Diglett dig and a Keldeo V another ultra rare goodness 
I'm gonna go ahead and sleeve that up. So hit that subscribe button, become part of the Breaking Family. Would love to have you. We are close to half a million subscribers. I'm gonna do something crazy when I get to half a million. I've already said it in a past video. I'm gonna do a cartwheel. <laughs> yes, I haven't done a cartwheel in probably decades. Uh, at least one decade. Um, probably that's it. Probably no more than one decade. But I'm gonna do a cartwheel at 500,000 subscribers and we'll open up some crazy stuff as well. But the cartwheel is what's important. Shelter Energy, don't forget to make sure you thank Nick down in the comment section down below for sending over these Dark Explorers. And if you're able to, make sure you check out the United Way uh, Worldwide link down in the video description down below, as well as the charity fundraiser if you are able to uh, donate to that to help raise, you know, as much money as possible with everything going on. All right, here we go. Ending with... A Vic Teeny V Ultra Rare Goodness ending today's Pokemon opening. Also, don't forget to check out Jordan French's video. Link in the video description down below. Breaking Family, that's it for today's Pokemon video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Check out these videos right here. I'll see you all in the next video. I love every single one of you all around the world. Do it with me now. Peace, love, and a high five.